You, you know, we spent the day at the camp here, and it is, it's heartbreaking. You know, you hear stories of families uh, who were in their house and, and when it was shelled. Um, you see the shrapnel scars on kids who are 10 and 12 years old. Um, I spoke to a number of women who have uh, been here for a year and a half. It's very difficult for them to stay in touch with their families who are still back in Syria. It is story after story of, of tragic loss, of sometimes brutality that they suffered. Um, and it's always the women and the children who suffer the most in these kinds of situations. Difficulty in finding a place to have their baby. Um, so it, it, these, are, these are the kinds of heartbreaking stories that make these crises so, so tragic.